Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Red ADC and welcome to this early, early edition of Saturday Knife Live. It is the first day of the Saturday of the month, so we always go live early with SKL, but we're a little bit earlier than normal this time. Man, the chat was lit up early. Thank you guys so very much for jumping in and having fun. Oh, Scott Raider, I'm sorry. I didn't see you in there earlier. I would have said hello much, much, much earlier. Welcome, Zach. DJ. Did I do it? Did I do it? Huh? Did I? Decor de Lamb, Top Dog, Uncle Cow, KJ, CPM, Donkey Dave, Williams Knife Life, Michael Morgan. Lots of guys in here earlier. Jack. Oh, I didn't see you earlier, Jack. Yes, I did. I said hi to you. Jack, Donkey Dave. Oh, my goodness. A lot of guys in here early. Very, very cool. Jason Brown, of course. Jason's usually always, always there early. And it's very, very, very much appreciated. Jake from Ohio State. I see you. GV, hello. Gino. Olivia's here. Very good. David Iverson, welcome. Sobix, hello. Oh, Lion, Leo, how you doing? You were here early too, my, my apologies. Randy, Alex, Christine, hey, aren't you supposed to be flying? Minette is here, Bill Rivers, hello. Oh, it jumped. It always does that. William Fields, welcome, welcome. Beefer's here, Todd Carr, Marcos is here. Oh, I think I said hi to Rusty. If I didn't, hello, Rusty. Charles Henning, welcome. Welcome. And let's see. Am I caught up? Jeremy Russell, hello, hello. I went early. Paul H, hello. Zeb, what's up? Hello. <laughs> Being dragged to a brat shower. <laughs> oh, you're getting on the plane now. Guys, Peter and Christine are headed to Vegas. Have so much fun, guys. Have, enjoy your trip. Have a wonderful time. Relax. Enjoy. And just enjoy one another. Let's just put it that way. Alex, thank you, man. Thank you so much. It's so funny. The brat shower. <laughs> that kills me. <laughs> Zeb, I love you. <laughs> Todd Carr, welcome, welcome. I did start a little bit early, guys, so we could get the so we can get through. I know we're planning a big trip today, so that's why we're early today. Um, I want to we want to get up and see those kids. We've got a lot to celebrate with them. Our oldest son, as you guys know, got engaged um, to a wonderful young lady, and we want to go celebrate with them. So very, very much. So Jesse Wilson, hello. People are jumping in. Very cool. All the rem members of Big Red's Brigade in the house. Thank you so very much for all your support. Um, I know I said it kind of in the 5K giveaway, which I picked the winners for last night. Awesome. Very cool. Five of the seven people have claimed their prizes already. So very, very cool. But as I said, that uh, I, I, a special thanks to my brigade members. I mean, you guys really, really helped make a lot of this possible. I'm not even going to play. You, you did. So thank you. All of you have. All of you have for sure. Uh, just by watching the channel. So thank you all very much. C. Lemansky, hello. Oh, William. Thank you. Let's give William some love. Show William some love. Oh my goodness. And then I just saw Zach pop in there. Thank you so much, my friend. We got to give Zach some love as well. Thank you guys so very much. You guys are awesome. What's that say? Super groovy. Congratulations in your 5K. Thank you, man. Thank you to the family and the 5K. Thank you so much. So, oh my goodness. Have I missed anybody jumping in here real quick? Stuart. Stuart Sexton. Hey, I'm not sure if you saw the video, but I haven't checked my email in the last little bit, but you were chosen as a winner in the 5K. So if you haven't seen it, you probably should, <laughs> but you should also probably email me, bigrededc at gmail.com because you, what did you get? 
you won the DECA package. So very cool. Very cool. So thank you all for your continued support. I just, I cannot thank you guys enough. Oh, you didn't? Yeah, dude. YouTube has been doing some really weird stuff. People have been talking about missing notifications. Um, comments. I, I know I've left like replies on like comments that you leave on my videos. I'll leave a reply. I'll go back and I always check. Uh, I always say reply to comments that I haven't replied to yet. And those those will come up. And it's like, I know I replied to those. So I don't know. I don't know. So very, very cool. I think I haven't missed anybody come in. I tell you what, guys, let's get this show on the road. What's everybody carrying? I'll show you what I kind of plan on being carried today, and we'll just get into this, and we'll have a lot of fun. And thank you very much, Zach, for throwing that link up there to uh, the Big Reds Brigade. I thank you so much. Hey, Todd Porter. We got Todd Carr. We got Todd Porter back to back right on. Jerome, hello. Yeah, it, I don't know what's going on. Paul Windmiller, Plains Crafter. Hi, KC. What's up, buddy? Good to see you. You're traveling too, man. Casey's on a trip. Peter and Christine are going on a trip. I think Zach's on a road trip. We're going on a road trip later. So, mm, lots of fun. Lots of fun. CK, hello. I saw, yeah, this, uh, YouTube's got the movies and stuff up now. So, that's kind of cool. So, all right. What do we got here? KJ's got the Fieldmaster, Minty Perry 3, Minty Para 3 Lightweight. Hydra Knives Vulture, very cool. David Iverson's got the Hinder MXM18. Uh, Bowie and a Finch 1929. Paul Windmiller's got the Evo 2.0 and a TIE 5.5. Sog Terminus and a TRM Viator. Viator? Okay. For Paul H. Bug Out with the Car my Carter Crossfade from Flightanium and the EMP EDC. Nimble for Z-Man. Sack Hiker for Olivia. Benchmade 940-1 for Zach Stuff. Ferrum Forge Stinger for Andrew Arnold. Hello, Andrew. GEC number 13, Whip for Planes Crafter. Oh, okay, Randy. All righty. Well, you know what? I'm glad you can, you're here and you can stay as long as you can stay, my friend. I appreciate it. Benchmade Access Limited Edition S90V G10 for Decure. Very good. And I hope I said it right. D DJ. DJ. I know in that comment you said, if you say DJ, you've got it 95% correct. So I kind of DJ. I hope I'm doing it right. Rick, hello. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, let's see. Zeb has the... MILF 01, SAC 7, and a Leatherman Charge Plus. Very cool. Scott Raider's got the Para 3. Alex has got the CJRB Malia, Malia in JG10. Boker Kalashnikov Mini Dagger cut with Copper Blade. CJRB Kicker Recoil. Doug Ritter RSK MK5. Right on. That's a loadout. CK's got the Mini Adamas and the Mini Osborne. Todd Porter's Rough Rider Classic Carbon 2 Whittler. Yes. Uh, Stuart Sexton's got the Mini Griptilian S30V. Jeremy Russell M4 Bug Out. Nice. Oh, don't jump. Too late. <laughs> Too late. Oh, my goodness. Oh, let's see. Gino, DLC S45 V Empire 3. Very good. KC's got the Hogue. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, there we go. K320 and the Rat, which you're loving. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Spartan Blades Palace in S35 VN, CBB Elementum in S35 VN, and a Victorinox Pioneer X for Rusty. Nice. Top Dog's got the Small Hunter. Tim, hey Tim, welcome, welcome. Got the Blue O Knife Driver and my Case Peanut and a Warrior Mini 2 Water Edition. Cool. We will definitely be talking about that Draver. Todd Carr's got the Gerber Clutch, Tucson TS16 M390, SR1, Cold Steel SR1. Nice. Michael's got the Revo Warden, which I which I gave you right on. Uh, you de-assisted it. Oh, very cool. And did your first die job. Excellent, Michael. Cold Steel Cold 
for Addicted to Blades 2. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Savivi Riffle for Uncle Cow. Savivi Elementum XL. It's not real, but I keep repeating it. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, TSA kind of frowns on that stuff, Christine. I definitely understand. Uh, Rough Rider Moose with Copper Shield, Victornot Spartan, a special big ninja. EHM. Rough Rider Blue Mule Sunfish. <laughs> nice, Jerome. Oh, very cool. DJ has the Benchmade 943. Jason's got the Best Tech Texel. Teal Design Fixed Blade, Utility Knife, Olai Warrior Mini, Right in the Rain Pouch with a Notebook, Machine Arrow Markup Brass Pin, Stat Gear Tweezers, OG Leatherman, and a Squirt PS4. That's a loadout. Nice. Oh, and we jumped again. Uh, Gordon Harmon, welcome. Aside from the ever-present Sack Explorer, I've got the Rough Rider Canoe, Bird Raven 2 in my pocket. Very nice. Uh, Best Tech Lizard for Johnny H. Nice. I just did a review on that one. That's a funky little knife. Uh, let's see. Lion, Spider Coast Smock, Green G10, O Knife Driver. Very good. Hello, Jim. Jim Shepard, welcome. Uh, Tops FDX 66 and a Benchmade Mini Adamas for Charles. Very good. Oh, have I caught up? Have I caught up? No, I just saw Charles Henning, Benchmade Mini Adams. Oh, thanks to Zach. Very cool. Jack, what do you got, Jack? Tour Knives Merchant today. Very good. Don's got the ST bug out. Welcome, Don. And I think I'm caught up. If I missed it, I'm sorry. Oh, Johnny H. Hello, welcome. Best Tech Lizard. You got one, too. Very cool. Very cool. Zenny's got a butter knife and crackers. Hey, better than nothing. Oh, very cool. What's that? Check out Facebook groups posting a video on my channel at the court. Oh, very cool. Yes, Lion, as we used to know as Leo, has a channel out. Very cool. New channel out there. Please feel free to check him out, see what he has putting out there to the community. Very, very cool. I I need to do that myself, as a matter of fact. So, all right. Very, very cool. We are up and rolling. So what, what am I carrying today? Well, as I said, the Draver. This is definitely one I'm probably going to be carrying today. I've been packing and stuff and getting ready for to go. Um on our little trips i kind of been running around um guys i'm telling you what i am pretty impressed by this knife now i'll be honest when it first came out i was like okay olight's putting out a knife i i really wanted to check it out this is the o knife driver from olight i am really digging the blue on black if you guys know kenny wayne shepherd at all blue on black one of my favorite songs terrific song um you know, I was a little leery about it. I'll, I'll, I'll be honest. But then I heard it was made by Kaiser. And I'm like, all right. Yeah, I, I definitely, you guys know me. I don't really chase knives. That's not really my thing. But I was like, you know, I really want to give this one a shot. Welcome, RJ. Very cool. Hey, tell us what you're carrying today, buddy. Welcome. And guys, I'm telling you what, this thing is so, so smooth. Uh, the detent is really good. There's no shaking involved. It just... Oh, I had to shake it that time. Okay. So, I lied. My bad. Oh, that's what I was worried about. It's a dropper. It drops. But, I mean, this thing is so, so nice. So nice. And I, I love, I love the profile. I love that blade. Uh, Tim says he's had his about an hour and likes it. Very cool. Hey, other than intended purpose, welcome. Glad. Let's see, RJ's got the trapper from yesterday's video, the roper. Nice. Nice. Yes, Jake, welcome to you too. I am liking this one a lot. Um, it, it's got a really good feel. Hey, 915, welcome. It feels really good in hand. The pocket clip. Yep, recessed pocket clip screws, fairly deep carry. There's just a little sticking out of there. But 
Oh, yes, Beefer, Five Finger Death Punch did redo that song, and they did it very well in my, uh, in my opinion. So, yes, indeed, I am really, really liking this. I did mention the original because, well, you know, the original. But, yes, Five Finger did a great, great version of that song. Chicago, welcome, BJ. Hello, hello. Welcome, guys. Glad to have you. Tell us what you're carrying in the chat. We'll catch up with you. This, yeah, I am, guys. This one's going to go with me. And um, probably another knife that I, I recently got on loan. But I really wanted to take a, a, a minute and shout out some people. Guys, I really, really wanted to do a comparison video on the, the 80s, 10, 15, 20, and 20.5. Um, the problem is I don't have any of them. <laughs> so that, that tends to be a problem. But thanks to Casey, Rusty Knife Lover, uh, Peter, Therapeutic Edge, and Jeremy Spaulding, I get to do that. And... I've been carrying them, comparing them, and it's going to be a lot of fun. Thank, thank you to you for for making that possible. I greatly, greatly appreciate. And I know I've said it a few times, but I, I'll have to get it done and get it out because I've had Rusty's knives, and I need to get those moving along. But hey, Navy85, what's up? You got yours and you like it? Very good. Very good. Hey, BH is here. Hello, hello, another brigade member that has his cardinal you'll see a few cardinals up there guys as next to names those people have been brigade members for a year thank you thank you guys so much thank you so much it's just you guys are fantastic and you all are you all are fantastic so thank you so much um so Oh, let me, I don't want to forget my place, but no. Oh, those four guys, Greg Wilson, welcome. Um, oh, you're going to a St. Louis Cardinals game this afternoon or tomorrow afternoon. Very good. Awesome. Um, yeah, thank you to you for, for making that possible. I greatly appreciate it. Again, the community stepped up and, and helped me out as you always do. And I'm, hmm, thank you guys. So, uh, one other thing, Nikki. Welcome. Welcome, Nikki. Uh, one other thing I wanted to throw out there. Uh, Nelly has been telling me that you guys have been uh, sending her some awesome questions, some awesome emails, and I can't thank you guys enough for helping her out with that. Um, it was something she really wanted to do, and I greatly appreciate it. If you, have, if you don't know what I'm talking about, Nelly is planning on basically doing a channel chat takeover and kind of Interviewing me, not kind of, that's what she's going to be doing. Yeah, it's been a year, BJ. I know, man. I know. I know. Um, so it's going to be a lot of fun. Thank you guys for helping her out. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, she's got a video. Um, you can go back and check out the, the video library and get that. Check it out. Uh, but thank you guys. Oh, Christine, alrighty. Bye. Like I said, have fun, guys. Have fun. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Remember, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Uh, will Nelly reply? Not sure she received. Um, I'm pretty sure she's been uh, replying to people. So, Vic, so I tell you what, um, I'll ask her. Um, but she's been replying. If it was in the la like last few hours, she probably hasn't. She's been running around this morning. So, oh, right on, Stuart. First time winning anything? Yeah, Stuart, if you just want to go ahead and email me and send your shipping information, that would be terrific. BigRedEDC at gmail.com. Thank you. That's awesome. And congratulations again. There you go. Zach threw up the link to Nelly's video. If you guys want to check that out and give her a hand, um... Thank you guys for doing that as well. Very, very cool. So, um, yeah, she was replying. 
she was trying to reply to everybody. So if she hasn't, I'll double check with her. I'll double check with her. So um, another cool thing that's coming up. Um, if you guys remember Austin from C. Reisner, uh, traditionalpocketknives.com, he just announced that he, oh, thank you, Zach. There's the, there's the email right there, Stuart. Zach just put it up there. <laughs> it might be, BJ. It might be one of the first times. You've been pretty lucky. Uh, Chris Wolf was a winner, and I know he won one not too long ago, so he's kind of on a lucky streak, so very cool. Uh, another brigade member, so thank you very much, Chris. Ian, hello. Welcome. Welcome. Um, but, oh, no, of course. I lost my place. Oh, <laughs> traditional pocket knives. Austin, really, really awesome guy. Runs traditionalpocketknives.com or C. Reisner. Um, stuff we do, welcome. He in announced that he will be having a knife coming out uh, very soon. I think he's saying the end of the year. So very cool. I'm very, very happy for him. If you guys don't know Austin, um, I really... I encourage you to go watch the channel chat with him and I. Um, he's an awesome guy. The story about how his grandpa started the business and now he's doing it. It's just, just fantastic. Okay, Olivia. All righty. I'll make sure she checks. Um, <laughs> it's so cool. It is so cool. And he's a really, really nice guy. Really, really nice. Really, really genuine genuine person and i would love to sit down face to face have a beer and just talk knives with him he's one of those you know like a lot of us are i'd like to sit down with a lot of you guys and have a beer and talk knives so but he is definitely definitely one of those guys like like i said we call ourselves knife guys he had a knife collection before he was even born thanks to his grandma so i think he pretty much defines the term knife guy if you have a collection before you're born so <laughs> smash that like button or convince it to select itself. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I've had Austin reply to stuff in my orders. Okay. All right, on. He is. He, he's very nice. He's a very nice. Oh, you're getting a sticker from him? Very cool. Right on. And as a matter of fact, there'll be a sticker in the swag pack today. So... You had a collection before you were born, KJ. There you go. All right. Okay. Speaking of, I did mention uh, Jeremy Spaulding. This is the last one that I had come in that I'm getting to check out. It's the AD15, guys. Wow. Just wow. Oh, CK. Oh, and Stuart. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Stuart. What did you do that, my friend? Thank you very much. There's some love for Stuart. And here's some love for CK. Thank you all very much. Thank you both. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. Oh, yeah, that was a fun one too, Greg. The one with uh, Greg and uh, TC. That was very fun. Very fun. All right. See you later, Nikki. Thank you so very much for joining us this morning. Always, always appreciate it. Uh, yeah, this thing is... Wow. <laughs> wow. The Scorpion Lock is very, very interesting. Um, well, I'm not going to give too much away right now because I really, really want to do it in the comparison. It's a beast. It is a beast, without a doubt. Um, the one thing I will say is the Scorpion Lock takes some getting used to. <laughs> yeah. It is a beast, without a doubt. Um, maybe not quite as beastly as the 8010, but it's definitely, and it's, I mean, it's solid. This is a solid knife. Um, I'm having fun checking these guys out. I really, really, I can't thank you guys enough all four of you for allowing me, especially Jeremy for the AD15. Thank you so much. Um, it's going to be a really fun video to do. Uh, I, I know they've been reviewed to death, but you know what? I haven't given my two cents worth, so why not? Why not? But it's very snappy, and it is droppy. Mm. 
And that's that's going to be kind of one of the things that I talk about when I do my review. I mean, I've only had it for a couple of days. What do I think about the Ergos? The Ergos are pretty good. I can't really, I can't really knock the Ergos a whole lot. I mean, it feels good. The clip, I mean, I can feel the clip a little bit, but it really doesn't. Oh, thank you, BJ. Your favorite's the 8010. Right on. Very good. Excellent. Thank you so much, my friend. Always appreciate your support. Without a doubt. Um, hey, Paul Hamilton, what's up? Welcome. This one, I don't know. It, it, I mean, the jury's still out. I haven't been with it for too long. Um, if I had a warhead cap on and a little pink in her beard, I'd be dime day, dime bag Daryl's twin. Oh, right on. <laughs> uh, rest in peace, dime bag. Rest in peace. Um, how do I? How do you disengage the lock? Okay. Uh, let's see here. The scorpion lock. The best way I can do it, and I have to keep this finger out of the way. This finger, and this finger, they're gonna. Mm. But you kind of pinch up here and lift up. And it kind of, you can see there, it kind of rotates on that cam right there. See that cam? It kind of rotates. The cam kind of rotates here. But that is the best one. That's the best way I can describe it. Yeah, I have to be careful, KJ. That's no lie. <laughs> um... I wasn't careful. Well, it's almost caught me many times. Yep, you lift. There you go. Oh, see? Oh, see? Look, guys. Look where that finger is. That finger keeps sliding up there. And it's... Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Uh, I'm not sure, Olivia. I'm not sure. Yeah. Uh, that's That's my... Well... I'll just say that's one of the issues. I've got a possibly knockoff AD15, and I have the exact same problem. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. It's just... Um... <laughs> BH. <laughs> yeah, it definitely takes some getting used to. Without a doubt, it does. You know, I'll be perfectly honest with you. For my hand size and probably lack of coordination yeah it is Klaus hello 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 coming from the time teller channel all oh, right on you got to play one of dime bags guitars once wow that's cool that's very cool Jared white hello welcome big worms in the house just popping in to say hi out shopping well very good thank you very much for doing so man um well it all depends it all depends if you're a little bit more coordinated than i am and probably have a little bit bigger hands uh but no bj the formax and the formax scout um i didn't include them in the i haven't i haven't um handled either one and i didn't really include those i was just kind of going with the 80s in this run the 10, 15, 20, and 20.5. So that's kind of where I'm running with that. 11 months and 27 days. Oh, well, you'll have your Cardinal next week. You'll have your Cardinal next week, Rusty. Nice. Hey, T Tree Stabbing Troy, what is up? Um, Speaking of next week, guys, just so you know, and keep your eyes out on the community, or yeah, on the community page for the channel. But next week is an SKL on the road, and it's going to be another early one. Um, that's just easier doing them early when we're on the road like that. Um, it's going to be at the regular early time, 2 p.m. Pacific. It's going to be an SKL on the road, and yes, it's going to be an SKL on, the, SKL on the road in Portland again. Um, Nellie and I have been trying to plan a trip to Portland since probably June. Winchester, what's up? Winchester's in the house. Um, and honestly, it just kept getting pushed back and pushed back because I didn't 
really feel like going, honestly. Acetone, welcome. Um, and that's why. So um, it's going to be at 2. We're going to do it at 2. I don't know where we're going to do it, at 2, at, <laughs> but we'll figure it out. And we'll have some fun uh, while doing it. Because I know there's some other people from that are in the chat right now that are going to be in Portland next weekend. So kind of want to make it fun. Have a good... Oh, I don't kind of want to make it fun. I always want to make it fun. Um, but we want to have some fun with it. So we'll just have to see how it works. You know? So, um, yeah. There he is. Some people were asking about you, John. Very cool. Let's do the hokey pokey. Let's do it. Rodney, welcome. Brad, welcome. Welcome. Very cool. Yes, indeed. Yeah. Yep. Z-Man's going to be in Portland. So we're trying to work something out. Gerber's a snoozer. Won't let people in. Aw. That's a bummer. Um, so, hey, K20. What is up with you? So thank you all for jumping in here. Rodney, Brad, we're, everybody's jumping in. All right, let me see. I got to look at my notes. I got to look at my notes. I know I'm pretty excited about making this trip today, guys, and seeing seeing the kids. It's, it's going to be a lot of fun. So if I am a little distracted, I apologize. I'm not trying to be. You have to work your next Saturday in a, in a year next week. Oh, all right. Okay, that's all good. I understand. I understand. Oh, wrecked. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> that's hilarious, Zach. <laughs> Thank you so much. Let's show Zach some love. Thank you. Oh, without a doubt. Without a doubt, Brad. Absolutely. Oh, Paul H. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Um, Paul H, please do me a, a big favor and email me bigrededc at gmail.com. Um, we'll get you some swag and stuff out for becoming a channel member today. But thank you so very much. Let's show Paul some love. We'll get show him some big red, big red's brigade love. Thank you very much for becoming a member, my friend. Greatly, greatly appreciate that. Um, but yeah, Brad, on that route one, um, for, for those of you that give you a little bit of context, Brad was asking me about a really good knife, um, a solid knife for under 50 bucks. And he told me he was kind of looking at the rat knives. And I told him that is a pretty solid knife to go with. Um, and apparently he took my advice, which is cool. Um, I don't think you will be disappointed. It's a good, solid knife, and it'll treat you right. Oh, Brandon, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you for being here. So I hope it treats you well, Brad. I really do. And I'm glad to have you, Paul. Paul H., I'm glad to have you. Oh, let's see. Oh, here we go. Now, here's one. Jamie loves... No, not Jamie. Jamie didn't send this one. My bad. Our good friend Jack at Suburban, too many J's, too many J's, Jack, Suburban Tactical Nation. I have a couple of boxes to unbox and one's for Jamie. So this is the Boker Plus Excalibur 2. Wow. Oh, right on, Z-Man. Very cool. This thing is really, really interesting. Now, I have not spent a whole lot of time with this knife yet, but it's a front flipper. It is slim. Oh my goodness, this thing is slim. You got carbon fiber. Oh. Oh, now I'm having trouble with the flipper. There. I'm trying to show you and flip it at the same time. And there you go, the lack of coordination kicks in. But ooh, I like that blade. Look at the profile on that blade. If you guys know me, you know I'm digging that blade. You know I'm digging it. S35VN blade steel on this one. Want to make sure I was telling you the right thing. Wow. Oh, YouTube's buffering. Oh, you're in the car. 
right on, right on, Manette. Um, yes, this is a very, it's a very sexy knife, very slim, very slender. And he asked me if I wanted to check it out. Um, I loaned him my uh, Chris Reeve so he could check it out. And he sent this one back. Very cool. Really, really appreciate it. Oh, for sure, BH. It's definitely, I mean, you guys know what I like. You guys know I like the, the Laconico, the plain, you know, simple lines. And, yeah, this fits that vibe very, very much. Very much. Mr. G, hello. Mr. G was one of our 5K winners. Yes, he was. Let's give him some love. We'll give we'll give Mr. G and we'll give Stuart some 5K winning love right there. Very cool. Congratulations. Thank you for getting a hold of him, uh, Mr. G. I've got your stuff, so we're good to go. Thank you so much. Backpack B's in the house. Nice. How's the grind? Well, it's, yeah, thin. Thin is what it is. Um, there you go. The blade stock. Oh, I don't have my calipers handy, but there you go. There's kind of a comparison. The blade stock between the bug out and the Excalibur 2. And it would appear to me that the bug out is. Oh, actually, the bug out's a little slimmer. I thought the Excalibur was going to be slimmer, but it's not. But it's not. Interesting. Um, like I said, I have not played with this knife very much yet. I'm not sure how slim and slicey and slippery it is. Um, and by slippery, I mean cutting. It's not slippery in the hand. This one, oh, this one's going to carry like a dream. I'm almost, I'll guess. I'll guess it is. I can't say it does because I haven't carried it yet. But it feels like it's going to carry like a dream. It's not very heavy. I mean, it's got a little bit of weight to it, obviously, but whoo. Um, I'm not so sure. Hmm. You know, by eyeballing, it doesn't look very hollow. I'll tell you that right now. Glad to have you, Backpack B. Glad to have you for sure. Forecast gonna carry like a dream. There you go. Um, it doesn't look very hollow. Oh, is Randy out? All right, buddy. Thank you so much for being here, my friend. It's always a pleasure to have you, without a doubt. Thank you so much. Yeah, it looks kind of you know, it doesn't look hollow to me at all. Mine, yours is, it's an older one. Okay, all right. And maybe I'm just like completely missing it, but it, it, it doesn't, it doesn't. Hollow like a Pantera song. <laughs> Jake's on the Pantera kick. Manny G, what is up? All right, hey, give everybody, give Manny Z a shout out. He helped out quite a lot with that. He sent that surprise, surprise in for the 5K giveaway. So let's give Manny a little bit of love. Him and Top Dog both. Top Dog is here. We'll give Top Dog some love. They both sent in those kind of surprise items for those surprise packages. So thank you both very, very much for doing that. That was very, very generous of you. So you guys are very, very, very shallow. Ah, it might be. If it's hollow, it's shallow. <laughs> it's a shallow hollow, if that's the case. Um, but yes, thank you. Thank you very much, Manny. Thank you very much, Top Dog. You guys rock. Um, I know I mentioned that in the giveaway last night, or the drawing last night. So very, very cool of you guys to do that, and I appreciate it. Definitely didn't have to, but super, super fantastic that you did. So, but yeah, this thing, guys, it's going to go with me. I think it and the Draver are going to go with me. I'm going to stay away from the bigger knives because we're going to be walking around and doing a lot of traveling. And those guys are Winchester's on a roll. Uh-oh, what am I missing? Oh, there we go. Oh, God. <laughs> Y'all are always on KC. <laughs> but, yeah, I will be carrying these, too. 
Oh, right on, Brad. Well, I thank you for stopping by, man. You're always welcome, my friend. Always welcome here. Uh, glad I didn't win the mini. <laughs> yeah, I know when you told me that. When you said you ordered the mini Adamas, I was like, oh, what if he wins? Uh, actually, Chris Wolf was the one that won the uh, mini Adamas package. So that's very cool. <laughs> Casey, it's not fair. They're picking on me. <laughs> He's traveling. He can't defend himself. <laughs> oh, right on. Right on, Manny. Which new knives have I been into, Centaur? Welcome. Um. Well, you, this one's pretty new, and I'm definitely into it. That's the Olight Driver. Um. You know, when they first came out, they were 52 bucks when they went on sale. 2,000 black, 500 blue. The 500 sold out pretty, pretty quick. Uh, yeah, the blue ones, they sold out pretty quick. These, I think, sold out in like a day and a half. Um, it looks like they're going to have more in. I guess when they go on regular sale, they're going to be... Oh, I didn't say it was N690 steel. Sorry. Um, eggs, what's up? Three inch blade limit for Blade West and a two inch for autos. Yeah, yeah, at Blade West. Alrighty. Well, we'll definitely have to take that into account, won't we? Well, it's from O Light and they call it the O Knife. And the name of the knife is Drever. It's O Knife. It's the O Knife Drever from O Light. That's what it is. Let's see. King saying, JB, what was the Copperhead concept? What was it? Uh, that was the one with the really, really wicked Hawkbill blade. That's the one you're asking about. Um, that was Top Dog sent that one in for the giveaway. So... Uh, that was the Hawkbill one. Wicked, wicked looking blade. The micarta on it's fantastic. It's an SMW, SMKW exclusive. Uh, the camshaft, the ca carbon fiber camshaft was an exclusive from SMKW as well. So I could carry the Torino, couldn't I? Yeah, that would be a good one. That would be a good one. Trust me, I have a few three inch blades <laughs> I'll be able to carry. I think I can find something that fits that. Uh, Definitely, definitely fit in with that. Um, no, they haven't started a new company. It's it's with Olight. It's with Olight. You know, from everything I know, it's the O Knife Driver from Olight. That's what I've been hearing. The Riffle, good knife. I like the Riffle a lot. Um, let's see. Well, we got some unboxings to do. Now, I know Zeb and Minette are here, and I got a couple of unboxings to do. Yes, it is made by Kaiser. That is correct. The driver is made by Kaiser. So, I have a box. And this is a congratulations on 5K from Zeb and Minette. So, thank you guys so very much for sending this. You definitely did not have to do that. Just for the record, JB and Zach Rock. Oh, thank you, Manny. Thank you. Let's see, what do we got? Oh, we got a sticker. We got a camo, right? Uh, just OD Green. OD Green DLT trading sticker. Yes, packages make me very happy. It wasn't ticking. It wasn't ticking, so... Oh, what do we have? Oh, look here, look here. Oh, it's a Victorinox. Oh, what is this? Evolution Grip S17. Red and black. Oh, oh goodness. <laughs> Yay. Um, I'm going to open it on the other end. Oh. Oh, yeah. Check it out. Check it out. Woo. 
I do have a package and a sack. I'm gifted, I guess. Oh, look at this little guy. Oh, this little guy might have to make the trip with me as well. Oh, yeah. Nice little spear point. Oh, what do we have here? I got to figure out how to use it. We got the file. I'm opening it. I'm opening it. <laughs> we got the toothpick. We got the tweezers. We got the corkscrew. Oh, we have the all. All? Change the all. Change the all. Um, gosh, what else this thing got on it? We got the screwdriver, cap lifter, flathead cap lifter. We got the can opener. Oh, let's see. This side? Nope, other side. Other side. Maybe other side. Front. Saw. We got a saw. Joe Lancelot is in the house. Hello. Welcome. Oh, there we go. What are we doing here? I gotta be smarter than the machine. Oh, that's the lock for the main blade. Very cool. Okay. Sweet. It's locking and everything else. Oh, that is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do I see what I think I see? Oh, I do. Ah, scissors. Yes. Yes. I love Victorinox scissors. Yes. They should make a Big Red Classic, Big Red EDC Classic. That's right, BH. Hey, KB, what is up? We will be coming to see you a little bit later there, my friend. Snip, snip. <laughs> yes, KB is the one I'm going to go visit later today. Very cool. Thank you so much, Zeb and Manette. I love this little guy. This dude is awesome. I love it. Are all of them locking? No, I guess it's just the main blade, I think. Very cool. Bill! Bill, hello! Hello, welcome. Dude, this thing is cool. Thank you guys so very much. This one's definitely going to have to... This one will make the trip with me. This one will go in my pocket, and it will go with me today. Always, always. I'm not hitting the saw. I have my tummy water. I have tummy water here. Not the saws. Unless that's the saws. The bottle opener, yeah. The bottle opener may get used tonight. The corkscrew may get used tonight. Who knows? We're celebrating. Oh, Cascade Card Wranglers. What's up? Glad you can make it. Oh, very cool. I will be doing I'll be doing a live next week sometime, guys. Uh the the care package will be coming. So I will be doing my live opening of it sometime next week, whenever it shows up. Um, that all depends on FedEx. I have an issue with FedEx out here for some reason. I don't know. Um, but yes, thank you, Manette. Thank you, Zeb. Is there, is there anything on the blade? Oh my goodness. I didn't notice anything on the blade. No, no, there's not Manette. There's nothing on the blade. I was gonna say I didn't I didn't notice. I didn't notice it. <laughs> KJ. Tom, what is up? Grim Reaper, hello, welcome. Welcome, guys. Bama, what is up? Welcome to you as well. So very cool. Thank you guys. Zeb, they didn't. No, Zeb, there's nothing. Oh, if you were supposed to have... Yeah, it didn't, bud. Let me check. There's nothing on the main blade. Let me let me just make sure. No, there's nothing on the saw. Let me check, guys. I, I'm going to check them. I mean, the other ones are really too small. No, guys, I'm sorry. They didn't. My apologies, guys. Uh, guys, I love it. I love it. David Lindsay, what is up? I love it, guys. 
I appreciate I appreciate the thought that you wanted to do that. And I'm very sorry that they didn't, but I love it. I just know, guys, I love it. Thank you very much. This is a wonderful, wonderful gift. It'll be it'll be with me always, guys. There's no question about that. So just know that that thank you very much. Thank you, guys. I know I need to look at the camera. Um, but yes, thank you so very much. It's going with me today. It will. It'll make the trip with me for sure. So I apologize. Um, if they were supposed to and didn't, well, I, I would get after them. I'd get some, you know? But hashtag get some. Get on them. Oh, have I got to? Oh, man, there's so much. So much. I might not make it through everything today, guys, because I'm really, really, really going to try to keep this to an hour so we can get on the road. But I have another package. This one comes to us from our good friend, Jamie Loves Knives. Um, he sent me a knife to check out. Jamie's done that a few times now. I really, really appreciate it. Um, you guys are just absolutely fantastic. Hey, EDC Oz, thank you. Thank you, thank you. And I, I did say hi to Tom. I'm pretty sure I said hi to Tom. Hello, Tom. Hello, Joe. I think I'm getting everybody. And if I don't, just wave at me. Whack me over the head with something, and I will definitely say hi, because I appreciate y'all being here. So let's see. What do we have here? It is an SKL shirt. It is indeed. Saturday Night Live. I had a few of them. I don't have very many left. Ooh, whoa. Whew. Look at this. Woo, wowza. This is the Hoback, guys. The Hoback Sumo. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Woo. Hoback Sumo. Yowza. Oh, right on, Zach. No worries, man. No worries. She thick. Yeah. Yeah, she thick, all right. Wow, man. I know. I love... Honestly, guys, I love, I know little to nothing, but I don't remember the steel on the Sumo. I'm hoping it says here. That says... What does that say? That says PS23. Whoo! This thing's a dropper. Oh, what do you got, Greg? QSP Snipe, Ordis, and a Lucha in hand when not typing. Right on. All right, Zeb. We'll talk, man. We'll talk. I understand. Jeremy Lawler, what is up? Wow. Oh, Psalm 23. That's right. That's right. Psalm 23. Very good. Thank you, KJ. Thank you. I did know that, too. Thank you. Wow, I know the, the color's not coming through very well, but this purple and black button lock. Woo-hoo-hoo, yeezy. That thing drops, man. Oh, talk about being careful and uncoordinated. I'm going to have to be careful. Yeah, Bees was talking about this one. Yeah, for sure. Wow. Got to go to the shower. Thank you so much, Minette, Zeb. Thank you guys for sending that. I'm really, really sorry that they didn't do what you wanted them to do, but I, I, I love it. And it's, thank you so much. I, I mean that. I mean that. Thank you. Uh, Patina, what is up? It's still one of the best knives. Patina Turner, or pa <laughs> screen names. I just love that. Ryan, what is up? How does the clip feel? That was my first, when I first saw it. George, what's up? Welcome, George French. I can definitely feel it. I can. I can definitely feel the clip. That's the one with the lock falling when smacking it. Oh, okay. Now, sauce. No sauce. No sauce. Not yet. There probably will be some sauce tonight. I can guarantee that. Rib tickling. Yeah, it's, it's, 
But <laughs> I like the blade. The blade's pretty cool. I like that blade. The purple's cool. The purple is cool. Oh, uh, is that for me, RJ? Sorry. Oh, okay. Okay, he's talking to Olivia. Okay, very good. Finger guillotine. Yeah, you better get your finger out of the way. My finger doesn't slip on this one, though. I got a good grip on it. I, well, the reason my finger slips on the AD-15, I believe, is because I have to adjust my hand to get to the lock. And like I said, that's kind of on me, lack of coordination and all that good stuff. Yeah, nice belly for sure. This is... Oh, it's definitely drop shutty. There's no doubt about it. Dang. Yikes. Uh, but very, very cool. Thank you so much, Jamie, for sending out the sumo. I'm going to have a lot of fun checking this one out. Uh, it normally... Uh, well, no. It would normally... Normally, the early ones start at 2 Pacific. Uh, who said that? David. David H. Um, no. And welcome, by the way. Uh, this one is early, early, just because we have some plans for tonight. So I wanted to do it. I wanted to talk to you guys and go enjoy some family time, which is going to be very fun. And the, a growing family, which is awesome. Very cool. Very cool. So, yeah, finger drops to the floor. I know. But super cool. Thank you, Jamie. Love it. I'm, I'm digging it. Really appreciate the loan, my friend. Very, very much so. Um, I got to show, I want to show these real quick, guys. I'm running, I'm running out of time. I'm sorry. DJ, DJ, DJ. Shane, hello, welcome. Welcome to the stream. Having drinks with the old dirty tyrant. <laughs> Careful what you say around these guys. DDA has DJ. Dang it. Dang it. DJ has bought some knives. Again, <laughs> he's on a bench made roll, man. Hello, Pioneer. Welcome. Welcome. Um, this is the 940 BK Tesh 2003. DJ bought this one. Had it sent to me to check it out. Yes. Yes. I'm trying, man. I'm trying. I, my brain is stuck with. The other way, I have to train it. I have to train it. Um, really, really, really cool. Um, oh, by all means, man, go for it. Buy all the knives you want. That's what we're here for, right? Very cool. I am liking this one a lot. Yep, DJ. He told me if I said DJ, I was 95% right. So I'm just tweaking it a bit. Oh, it does look very nice. And it's, you know, it's got that, there we go, blue on black, as we were talking about before. Blue on black, tears on a river. Uh, yeah, I love the look. I love that look. Definitely. It's got the mini deep carry clip on it. Really, really cool. It's got a good feel to it. Really good feel. It's not slippery. I like that. Uh, no, he said he had a phone call. He was taking a phone call, Olivia. So, and he's on a road trip. So if he's, if he's out and doing things, that's terrific. I was just singing that. <laughs> there you go. There you go, KJ. Another really, really cool knife. No, no worries, Zach. Not at all. Please don't. No apologies necessary. James, what is up? Welcome. Joker on Jack. There you go. There you go. Um, so it's not quite as smooth yet. I don't know. It might be brand new. It needs a little tweaking, uh, DJ, but I'll let you do what you do to your knives. But very cool. Thank you very much. Um, I'll take a quick look at it and get it sent out to you um, for sure. I'll get them, get them out. Evolved, what is up? Fellow knife nerd in the house. Evolved DDC. So there's that one. And one more, one more. He also bought 
a bench made. Oh, of course, man. Of course, man. It, no, it's not a, not a problem at all. I get to check out cool knives, so <laughs> I'm having fun with it. But, uh, oops. We had the mini, uh, mini. Now we have the Presidio 2. Whoo. This one. Yeah, buddy. Oh, whoa. Little snap back there. Nice. Goods. There's another good sized, solid, solid knife. Oh man, that really feels pretty good in hand. Holy moly, holy smokes, Mark, what is up, buddy? Yeah, Presidio two right here. Oh, it's meaty. It's a meaty one for sure. Yes, 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 DJ. It is a hoss, definitely. But it's a pretty good feeling hoss, I'll tell you that. Excellent grip on it. What do we got here for the steel? S30V, and it is a first production, and it's a two-digit first production as well. I fire. Wow, old eyes, my goodness. Wow. Um, I think it says 84 or 70. Gee, many Christmas, guys. 39, 39, nice. 39 of, what was that, 1,000? I think that's what the first runs are, right? Zach will tell me, no. Yeah, 1,000, yeah, that's a one. 39 of 1,000, very cool, very cool. Yep, 39, you're right. Very cool. Hey, Lion, welcome, welcome. Shush. <laughs> I know. It's probably getting to that point. It's probably getting to that point. I needed some light. I'm blaming it on I needed some light. So another really, really nice knife. Oh, Joe's out. All right. See you later, Joe. Thanks for stopping by. Greatly appreciate it. It doesn't carry that big. I, You know, I have not carried this one yet. Sorry, did DJ. I haven't. Um, I've been working on the whole cold steel run uh getting those i really wanted to carry those as much as possible i have not carried this one as much so oh dude you should be you should be stoked very cool so thank you very much for the opportunity to take a look at both of these i greatly appreciate that oh all right guys well you know what um we've been going for right about an hour um I have a couple more. I had a couple more things to show, but I think we're just gonna kind of. Hey, Anita, welcome. Glad to have you. Um, I think we're just gonna kind of breeze through, and uh, well, you know what? Real quick, guys, we got more good stuff coming from Titan Survival. More really good stuff. Um, they're adding some Takamo backpacks. This is the thirty-five liter pack. This one, and there's a fifty liter as well. Um, 11 pockets, heavy duty Cordura, YKK zippers. This is very, very. Oh, no, no worries, Bill. Really, really nice pack. They sent this out. Nice cushion. Uh, I'll, I'll try to get it on next week, guys. Well, I'm going to be gone next week, too. We'll see it. We'll definitely see more. But I wanted to just to get it out there and let you know. I will have a review coming on it for sure. It's pretty much become my new kind of truck truck pack so yeah go go gadget bag exactly you've got the pals it's pals compatible you've got velcro here it needs to be bigger velcro so i can get my other patches on there zach you know what i mean you know what i'm saying so for right now it'll have the titan survival patch on there but i'm pretty sure that'll get replaced we'll see maybe it will yeah, it, it's a nice pack, and I'll, it, I'll bring it with you. I'll bring it with me, KB, so you can, you can check it out if you want to. So let's do a giveaway, guys. Let's give some stuff away so me and Nelly can get on the road. We're very, very excited for this, guys. Very, very excited. Uh, the price on that one, the 35 liter, I believe they're selling for 116 
on TitanSurvival.com. I believe it's 116 that they're selling for. The 50 liter is 160, if I remember correctly. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure it's close. Pretty sure it's close. So, um, yeah, that's what it is. So, all right, guys, it's giveaway time. Let's do this. I'm ready for the road. Yes, I am. I'm very excited. Nellie and I are very, very excited to go spend some time with our kids. As always, guys, we got swag. We got all sorts of swag. What I get you for your birthday, JB? Um, what I get you for your birthday, Z Man? Um, you put me on the spot. <laughs> No, 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 this is my hat, this is my hat, this is my special hat, special hat, right there. We got swag, of course, we always have our Zach stuff swag. We do have a mini, a cane, hey, hey. We do have, oh, where's it at? There it is. We got the mini DSKFS in there. It's Wednesday. Your birthday's Wednesday. Well, I tell you what, I'll buy you a beer. How's that? I'll definitely buy you a beer. Um, we have a pin. Our buddy Jack from Suburban Tactical Nation sent us a pin. So we have a Suburban Tactical Nation pin. We have a Grady's Gear um, magnet in there. Um, of course, you got all the Big Red EDC stuff. You have, hello, Sue. Welcome. You have all of my swag. Yes, there's a hula picture in there. You got a Southern Edge. You have traditional pocket knives, C.S. Reisner, Southern Edge Knife Works. Oh, thank you so much, BJ. Show BJ some love. Thank you very much. Thank you, brother. Greatly appreciate it. Um, let's see. We got Dam Designs. We have Hogue. We have Finch. Long Island Knife Guy. We have Eggs and Ham. We got lots of stuff in there. Last Ranger. We definitely have some Last Ranger slag in there. All the good stuff. All the good stuff in there. Knives Fast. We have Knives Fast, definitely. So, what else? What else? Oh, and we have one of Jared's stickers. Yes, I forgot to say that. Thank you, Jared, for popping up there. Uh, Jared had these awesome stickers made up. DSKFS, a community with a point. These are very, very cool stickers. Um, I think it was an awesome idea. Uh, very cool. Thank you for making these up. He sent a bunch of these along, and there will definitely be one in there. Whoa, Brad, what's up, man? Good to see you, buddy. I'm sorry we haven't talked in a while. That's my apologies on that. But thank you, Jared. Glad to see you, buddy. You live just right down the road. I think I, t I think I would come see you more. We got to do that, too. We got to do that. Everybody say hi to Brad. Oh, and Russell. Russell's here, too. My goodness. Sweet. All right. Let's see. All right, guys. I had one of these left over, so I'm going to throw it in today. It's, a, it's kind of the i3 UV EOS. It's the UV version. Of the i3 EOS. I love these little lights. These are pretty cool. The little UV ones. Always fun. Great little light. Yes, KJ, I know you don't like O-Light. I'm sorry, but it is what it is. <laughs> and... This is actually a knife, guys. This comes from the Apex Pass Around group. So hey, let's uh, let's show a little love. I'm gonna show a little SKL love to the Apex Pass Around guys. A lot of the knives that you see on the channel come from the Apex, and I really, really appreciate them. But as some of those knives, 
get given away to those of us that review them. Um, our names go into a drawing, and we get drawn pretty pretty much like we do any other. Oh, dude. Oh, for sure, Curtis. Yeah, man. Thank you. Thank you very much. There's some love for Curtis. Thank you so much. And like I said, next week it'll be early as well, 2 p.m. Pacific. But these knives get given away to some of us. And, you know, just like anything else, guys, I'm going to pass it along to you. So this one is the Lanny. The CRKT Lanny. Very interesting knife. It is assisted. Yes, it is. As you can see there, it is assisted. Um, it's got the silver. I like the silver and blue. I really like how that looks together. Um, it's got the, you know, that kind of buckshot bone or sort of finish to it. But very cool. It's a cool little knife. Um, yep, there you go. So that'll be the one. So guys, help me give a shout out to the Apex Pass Around um, for doing this. It is the Lanny. Leon Ma design, of course, after his uh, custom. But what is DSKFS? That is an excellent question, Paul. DSKFS is do something kind for someone. That is pretty much Zach's mantra. And it's, a, it's an idea that a lot of us get behind. I mean... It's something you guys know. It's something I've been doing on the channel as well. It's just a way to give back and just do something kind for someone. It could be as little as holding the door open, um, saying hello, wishing somebody, you know, have a nice day, you know, but maybe just something that you never know. It could change somebody's entire attitude. So that's what it is. And we need a lot more DSKFS. We definitely do. We definitely do. We need a lot of it. So that'll be our giveaway. All right. So for those of you that are new, you are begin you're gonna be guessing a number. One number, one guess, one number, one guess, one number. Um, I will give you the range as soon as I know it. Yep. Exactly, did you make the world a better place one one small act of kindness at a time? Um, let's do. I'm gonna do this one. How many do we have? Ninety one. Awesome. Very cool. And I'm gonna choose. That that'll be our number. All right. I have it right here, guys. I'm going to fold it up, but it's going to be one guess. One guess only. Closest without going over is the winner. Um, if we're, we have a tie or we have more than one, you know, we'll get, a, we'll get it done. I'm going to put it right here so it's right there. There's the number. No hanky-panky. <laughs> um, so whenever, Zach, if you want to throw a startup on the screen, my screen is the official screen. Yes, Price is Right rules. Exactly. Price is Right rules. Um, when Zach throws a startup on the screen, I will give you the range. One guess. One guess only. I'll give that to you, uh, Decor, just as soon as I see a start on the screen. People like to guess early. <laughs> and they're usually off. So I usually wait for the start. One guess, one guess only. Uh-oh. Zach might be on another call. I tell you what, I'm going to... Here we go. He might be out of range, too. So there you go, guys. I'm, I got the start on the screen. Go ahead. Your range is 300 to 450. 300 to 450. Yeah, he's, he might still be on a call. So we, we got it. We, we, we got it. We're all good. Hey, now, Sergeant, what is up? 300 to 450. Go ahead and make your guesses, guys. One guess, one guess only. And we will find us a winner. Oh, a knife dude's been lurking. At least I haven't said him said hi. <laughs> the number you're trying to reach is out of order. Yeah, very true. 
Oh, you're always welcome to you're always welcome to get in, Olivia. Um, so one guess, one guess only. Three hundred to four fifty. Three hundred to four fifty. And I'm not sure I have any other moderators in here because Zeb had to leave. So y'all gonna have to help me out. Keep me honest. Well, if I didn't see you, Knife Dude, I am sorry. And I'm glad you're here. 300 to 450. Make sure you guys are caught up. I should have said that before. Uh, it's all good. We got it. We got it. It's much easier to do it when it's face forward. It's much easier for me to do it when it's face forward. Oh, there's Rick. Rick's here. He's a moderator. Thank you, Rick. Katie, hello. Curtis, hello. 98. Whoa, we're almost at 100. Woohoo! We've only hit 100 once, guys. We've only hit 100 once. That'd be cool if we do it again today. Special day. All right, Jan, what is going on? Did somebody see 100? If it did, that's cool. That's awesome. It'll tell me at the end. All right. Make sure everybody's got their guesses in. I don't want anybody to be left out. I don't want anybody to be left out. There, Charles got his guess in. Yeah, I'm seeing 96 right now, too. I saw a 98 at one point. That was cool. 666 minus 7, the fifth power. To the Oh, my God. No, no, I'm not even going to try to figure that out. If that's your guess, I can tell you, you lose, William. <laughs> I'm not even going to try to figure that out. <laughs> not even. It was 100? Oh, cool. Awesome. Very cool. Very special day. Very, very special day. All right. Michael got his guess in. I'm going to lead it run just for a little bit more, guys. Oh, man. Very cool. It's an awesome, awesome day. I get to spend the day with doing a live with you guys, which you know I get I love to do. I get to spend the day with Nelly and my kids. And ah, what a terrific day. Couldn't be better. Couldn't be better. All right. Do we have I think everybody has got their guesses in. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it moving, guys. I don't want to leave anybody out, but I got to keep her moving. All right. All right. Our winning number, our stops are up. Our winning number is 373. 373. So, Rick and everyone, if you give me a hand. Oh, Mike, 374. Just over. My goodness. Oh, 371. 915 with a 371. That's close. That's close. Three seven three, and so oh, top dog with a three seven four, and a, oh three seven six oh three seven four was a popular number. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, you guys were just over. oh Anthony Bates, Anthony Bates with three seven three. Anthony Bates with a 373. That's the only one. Oh, David H. 372. Oh, 373. Anthony Bates. I'm saying that so I remember it, guys. That's what I am seeing, guys. Anthony Bates with 373. Yep, that sure looks like 383 was from Mopar. <laughs> yeah, yep, yep, yep. 373. Anthony Bates. Very, very cool. Well, it looks like. He should have gone with the equation. <laughs> Very cool. Anthony, congratulations, man. You win the L Lanny, the Olight, and all the swag. Very cool. Uh, do me a favor, Anthony. Uh, email me, bigrededc at gmail.com. Let's see. Let's make sure. Bigrededc at gmail.com. Did I write it right? I know I've screwed it up before. All right. It looks right. <laughs> 
BigRedEDC at gmail.com. Thank you so very much. Thank you, Rick, for your assistance as a moderator today. Thank you very much to Zach. Let's give Zach some love. Guys, if you are not subscribed to Zach stuff, uh, you're wrong. <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. I just don't. Uh, thank you so much, Zach. Hashtag Zach Attack. He was on the road. Um, and he still did this, still with throwing out links for me. So thank you very much. Thank you, Rick, for your help as well. And guys, I hope you have a fantastic Saturday. I hope you have a fantastic rest uh, Sunday, the rest of the week. Um, very, very exciting. Looking forward to later on today to spend some time with our kids. And next week, guys, next week, SKL on the road from Portland, 2 p.m. Pacific. 2 p.m. Pacific uh, next Saturday, guys. Another early one. So thank you very much, guys. Greatly, greatly appreciate all the support for all of you that have donated and super chats and just being here, taking part in the live stream. Thank you very much. And, guys, I will see you right here next week for another edition of Saturday Knife Live. Bye, guys. <laughs>